Good evening. Welcome to Expat Insights. I'm your host, Raju Mandian. Here at Expat Insights, we take external views of the internal successes by foreigners, expats, and immigrants who have made Philippines their home. Today is a very special day in the history of Expat Insights and the history of Philippines because we have a very special guest. This is a guest that came in unannounced. We did not know he was coming in, and he came down from the chimney just this afternoon. And he's been here with, all, with us all afternoon. He hails from the North Pole, his real name, Santa Claus. And he's here to wish us and bring us the merry joys of Christmas. Santa Claus, welcome to the Philippines and welcome to Expat Insights. It's wonderful to be here. Oh, 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 it's great to be here. You know why? I've been, I've never been to the Philippines before and it's so warm so I've taken my boots off today because it's, it's very warm here in the Philippines but I want to say to all of the beautiful children here in the Philippines, oh ho, have a wonderful, wonderful, merry, merry Christmas and I will come along with my reindeers and I will see you all very soon on Christmas Eve but you've got to be very good. Otherwise, are you smiling? You see, there's something you can't buy. You don't have to have things to give out at Christmas. Do you know that? You don't have to have presents. You know what the nicest present is? See? See that? You can't buy a that. Smile, a smile. A smile. And what you say to your parents and to your brothers and sisters and all you have to do is to say, what do you have to say? I love you very much. <coughs> On a very special day, because Santa comes along to all the boys and girls around the world. Ho, and you're ho, ho. very special. Ho, 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 ho. Santa. Oh, it's a wonderful time we're going to have. And it, this is a very special Christmas, isn't it? This is, yeah, it always is. Santa, I have a question for you. We, some people knew you were coming to us, uh -huh. and they sent us some requests and some questions. Uh -huh. So can I ask you one? Yes, of course. Santa, in these times, I understand you still use the reindeers. Oh. And uh, is that okay by you? Is that okay for the, for the global... Uh, Warming, is that okay to use animals oh, to ride and absolutely. travel across the world? Absolutely. You see, what people don't understand about my reindeer, yeah. my reindeers are very, very special. You see, the reindeers, they've come from different countries and people don't know the stories about my reindeer. My <laughs> reindeer, like Dancer and Prancer, they came from America. They were in Hollywood, but when I advertised that I needed extra special reindeers, they came to the North Pole, and they came there. And the other one, I have one very special reindeer. Did you know that you have deers here in the Philippines? Deers in the Philippines? Yes, yes in you Kage do. In Cagayan de Oro. That's there are lots right. of deers, yes. And I have one. His name is Donut, and Donut is a Filipino Reindeer. Donut? He, like, donut. Like Dunkin Donuts? Donut. D-O-N-E-T. Donut. Oh, Have donut. a look okay. on Santa's website and you'll see Donut. And Donut is a very special reindeer because he is the fastest of them. And he knows Manny Pacquiao. Is he faster than Rudolph? He, oh, yes. Yes, yes. He is the very... He's the commander of the reindeers. And he, you see, what makes reindeers so fast, you know, it's a secret. Because all of these people can't do what the reindeers do. The reindeers get fed a special, special food just before we leave to go off. For, that's why we're so fast. And the magic sleigh, which was made by my little elves. The magic, the sleigh, it's very, very special. Did you know that? It's a very special sleigh, and that is made... Doesn't use diesel or gas? No, no, it doesn't. It just uses reindeer power, except, except when we get to Australia. Because when we get to Australia, I give the reindeers a rest. 
and I use kangaroos. Oh, oh, oh there's oh. six kangaroos. There's Ned, Ted, Red. Ned, Ted, and Red. And then G'day, Fair Dinkum. G'day, G'day. And Sheila. That's, it. That's the six. Oh, okay. And they take me all the way around Australia. And the reindeers have a rest. And then we're off again. We're off to over the date line into America and do all of this. So we, we're very, very busy at Christmas, you know. And Santa, I have another question. Yeah. Uh, you come only on Christmas, during Christmas. Yep. What about Thanksgiving? What about Easter? How, what keeps you busy during those days? Well, that's the time I have my break. Mrs. Claus and I, last year... Mrs. Claus, there is a Mrs. Yeah, yeah. Claus. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Well, well, what is yes, her first Maggie. name? Maggie. Ma Maggie. Maggie, okay. Yeah, yeah. But, you see, when at Easter time is the one time we get a break. Easter we, time. Uh, Easter time, that's right. Is it and summer in uh, the North Pole during that time? Well, in the North Pole, this year, yeah. this year we're actually planning, or next year, yeah. we're actually planning to go to Africa. Because oh. we want to see oh. the elephants. Oh, okay. We once saw the elephants in Thailand. Right. They were very, very good. Right. And they give us a ride. There was an elephant called Cindy. And I thought... Cindy? That, yeah. I'd like to take her to the North Pole. But uh, they wouldn't let me take her. And she was too heavy. She was a Thai elephant? Mm. Yeah, she uh, was indeed. Now, how is it that you and Mrs. Claus are able to manage to deliver all these gifts in just one day? How do you manage to do that? 365 days you rest and you prepare, yeah. but you deliver everything on Christmas Eve. That's How do you manage that? Do you use DHL or FedEx or yeah. UPS or Pedala in the Philippines? Yeah. They're too slow. That's too slow? Okay. They're too slow. They take two, three days to... Le we have to do everything in one. That's why the reindeers get fed special food. Yes. And that makes them magic. <coughs> it's mm. a magic sleigh. We take off and we're gone. Mm. It's so quick. Mm -hmm -hmm. And I'm so, well I am, I mean I don't look quick, but I am. You know what's happened, Mrs. Claus, yeah. has been giving me too many cookies. Right, I can see that. We can see, can you see that? Yeah. Have we yes. got any cookies? No, no, no cookies. Got any cookies. Oh, okay. So Mr. Claus, Santa Claus, Santa, dear Santa, I want to ask you this, no? Uh, how did you come about? When were you born? Can you remember the time when you were as small as him? Were you ever a small, young boy? Well, I actually, you, we have to go back a long time. Where because do we you go? See, oh, you go by, way back into... North uh, Pole? Into, no, no, no. We go back for the first giving. The first oh, giving. Oh, right, right, right. The right. first giving with the three kings. Hmm, 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 they hmm. brought along gifts for Jesus. All right. See, that's what they did. And okay. so... That was an idea that God liked. So what he did was, I was in the North Pole with my friends and my family, mm -hmm. and it, he decided to get me to do the gifts for the children. Who? Who? Well, God did. Oh, all right. Your, your, your yeah. commander, your That's boss. That's right. right. He's right. the one, and he said, yeah. we will now, what we will do is, we will um, um, give children a Christmas presents all mm. around the world. Just because the kings brought gifts for yes. Jesus oh, from that day on. So you were a little boy at that time? I was, yes. Right, I'm right. very old now. Oh, well, you're still healthy and strong. Yes, 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 yes. yes. So, uh, Santa, I have another question. Do you have a question for Santa? Santa, where is the gifts? Ah, where, Santa, where, where do you keep the gifts? Oh, How do you carry yes. so many yes. gifts at the same time? Like all the gifts are... Well, you see, the elves make uh, the gifts. We have right. a factory. Yeah. And in the factory, we have... Which is a secret village. Way up in it, the North is Pole. Is it in the Philippines? In, oh, no, no. No, no, no it's not. It's the, way up in the North Pole. And in there, there's, we have a special factory that makes all the toys. But the good thing about the toys today is, you know, the little ones. The little boys and girls still like Barbie dolls and trains and choo-choos. And they still like the wooden toys and things like that. It's, yeah. it's, it's boys like you and, and girls, girls and girls, and yeah. girls yeah. that what they like, iPods and iPhones yeah, and yeah. all of these wonderful... But it makes things easier for me. Yeah. Because years ago, you know, I had to go around and give out prams and bikes and it was very bulky these days it's just 
little things like an Be, iPad you, phone. You think those are good toys nowadays, Santa? Yeah, well, I think they, 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 they keep the world. Everybody knows. Do they keep the children physically fit? To no. Be just, they don't. No. no you need a football. You need a football. You need or a football, a, don't you? Oh, yeah. That's what you need. What, yeah. What's your favorite? Football or something else? Something else. Something else. Santa, I have another question for you. Yeah. Santa, how do you decide between naughty and nice naughty and nice because oh. you give gifts to only nice people how do you differentiate yeah. between naughty and nice well naughty and nice comes <laughs> 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 what it does is naughty and nice comes from a long time ago when somebody composed a song but you know you know the song no there are no children who are naughty oh you know that? oh i like you that know? i like that because some children get tired, don't they? The and they get tired, and sometimes they get grumpy. Little See, children? Little, well, they get grumpy, but they're not naughty. They're not naughty. So we don't have, there are no naughty children. All children, Santa loves all children. So they become grumpy sometimes, but they're they get all... tired. Because they get tired or stressed. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, so you give gifts to everyone, naughty mm -hmm. or nice. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there's nobody naughty. So, so Santa, how about grown-up children like me? Are we naughty sometimes? No, I think sometimes they forget. We they forget. just forget to be. Sometimes we forget to be kind, mm -hmm. and sometimes we forget to forgive mm -hmm. and forgiveness, and sometimes we're not very humble about ourselves mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and it's very important that people